What's up, y'all? It's Emil Ennis Jr. back here with Clever News, and Lily Reinhart is facing criticism for defending the Riverdale creator while her fellow castmates are speaking out about the show's racial issues. In case you missed it, over the past couple weeks, Riverdale cast members like Vanessa Morgan have called out the writers of Riverdale in a series of tweets amid the Black Lives Matter movement. Vanessa said, quote, I'm not being quiet anymore. Tired of how black people are portrayed in media. Tired of us being portrayed as thugs, dangerous, or angry, scary people. Tired of us also being used as sidekick, non-dimensional characters to our white leads. Or only in the ads for diversity, but not actually in the show. It starts with the media, I'm not being quiet anymore. And she also revealed that while she's the only black series regular, she's also the least paid. The show's creator, Roberto Aguirre Sacasa, issued a public apology to Vanessa. He said, quote, we hear Vanessa, we love Vanessa, she's right. We're sorry and we make the same promise to you that we did to her. We will do better to honor her and the character she plays, as well as all of our actors and characters of color. Change is happening and will continue to happen. Riverdale will get bigger, not smaller. Riverdale will be part of the movement, not outside it. But Vanessa wasn't the only Riverdale cast member to speak out. During a recent Instagram Live with Lily Reinhardt, actress Asha Bromfield, who played Melody, the Pussycats drummer, discussed the Black representation on the show. I feel that the media plays such a big role in this. I think Hollywood has such a huge responsibility um, in this narrative of humanizing Black people. Asha went on to echo Vanessa Morgan's sentiments that she was tired of playing a sidekick. She said, I'm so much more, and Black people are so much more, than support systems. It becomes toxic messaging when we are perpetuating this idea that there's any less validity to my own life than yours, that my sole purpose in this world is to support someone who looks like you. It's so much bigger than Riverdale. It's a bigger conversation about how we are humanizing Black people on screen in all capacities. And at one point during the live stream, Lily brought up the Riverdale creator's apology to Vanessa. Lily said that she was proud of Roberto for the work they were doing on the show. Lily said, quote, I talked to Roberto the other day and he said that he felt like he wanted to bring the Pussycats back to the show to do right by their characters. I think people are learning and growing and we have to give them a chance to make the adjustments. We can say this isn't work or this is wrong, this needs to be fixed. Now it's like, okay, let's give people a chance to learn and make those changes. And Lily went on to defend Roberto and some fans were not having it. Roberto prides himself on, he wants Riverdale to be spearheading a movement of a television show that takes what's happening in the world right now and actually does something about it. Fans took to Twitter to share their thoughts on what Lily had to say about Roberto. One person wrote, quote, Lily defending Roberto was straight up her privilege talking. She doesn't know what it's like to be mistreated on the show. Vanessa, Asha, and Ashley been through and mistreated constantly. Yeah, he's learning, but the only reason he apologized was because we called him out. Another fan chimed in and said, quote, Lily needs to realize that she cannot respond to the situation because she will never understand what it is to be a black woman employed by Roberto. And the only way these Insta lives are going to work is if she talks less about it and listens more. And this person called both Lily and Roberto out saying, quote, I'm sorry, but I gotta disagree with Lily saying Roberto is learning. This man is grown and this is not new. Please, he's only learning now because he got rightfully called out. But other fans came to Lily and Roberto's defense saying that they need space to learn. Like this person who wrote, quote, this is new for a lot of people. We can't shame people who are trying to learn. The whole point of this movement was to educate. Yes, hold Roberto accountable, but give him a chance to take in the outcry and grow. Another person added that there was way more to Lily and Ash's conversation than this one bit about Riverdale. They wrote, quote, it was dynamic. I didn't even care about it. There was so much intelligent conversation on the live that it's irrelevant. This fan agreed saying, quote, couldn't watch it earlier, but Lily and Ash's Instagram live, so good, educational, and inspiring. Your words, girls, were amazing, thanks. And this person wrote, quote, Lily Reinhardt and Asha Bromfield had one of the most enlightening, mature, and engaging conversations I have seen. Asha is 100% right. Even if Lily was uncomfortable, she allowed herself to listen to Asha and her struggles to try and understand and grow, and that is all we can ask. And Lily has been continuing to share her platform with Black activists, actors, advocates, and creators. The conversations are all saved on her IGTV and are definitely well worth watching. And if you want more on what Vanessa had to say about the racial inequalities on Riverdale, click right over here for another Clever News video. And let us know your thoughts on Asha's and Lily's conversation down in the comments section below. I'm your host, Milanis Jr., and I'll see you soon right back here on Clever News. Bye, guys.